first race, Phillies and Mares claiming pacers are all moving in behind the gate for the first half of the early double. A full field of 10, nine on gate, one of the second tier. The gate swings into the back stretch and they're in the hands of the starter, Andy Albert. This field is in motion. They're all fan pacing, driving out from the outside. And Love Thy Neighbor is rolling on from the inside. Kiki's Magic, three wide to join the fray. That is SF Flyby. Coming away, racing in fourth is Ombro Willow. Next from the rail there in fifth is Excellent Prospects. Six to the inside for the second tier is VC on time. Got to the outside of there in seventh is Broadway Ashley. Off stride and rough gated there went the 10 VC on time. Scattering the three trailers here of Kiera Cress. Pages Promise and also Townline Indy Power. The opening quarter came and went in 28 and two fifths and driving on by the stands for the first time. An excellent prospect is being brushed to the top here with less than five eighths of a mile to travel. And to the inside, Kiki's Magic is racing to SF Flyby to apply immediate pressure to the outside in third. Love Thy Neighbor is watching over the top trio from fourth. Fifth on the inside, Umbro Willow. As they step around the clubhouse turn, they're at the half. They're halfway home in 58 seconds flat. With the outside of there, racing in six. That is Kira Kress. Seven to the pylons, Broadway Ashley. Eighth and a move to the outside, Pages Promise. Ninth, that is VC on time. And tenth and trailing town line, Indy Power. With less than three-eighths of a mile to go, they're traveling down the backside. And up top, excellent prospect. With the lead here, by length and a quarter. To the outside, racing in two. That's SF Flyby, who continues to gain ground. At the rail, that is Kiki's Magic. Second over the outside, racing in fourth there, Umbro Willow. Three-quarters, 120. Seven and two fifths. Fifth on the inside, and Love Thy Neighbor is beginning to look for racing room here. Third over the outside, racing in six. Kira Cress is being fanned three high as they turn to the top of the stretch. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Excellent prospect to the inside. SF Flyby on the outside is coming at her and coming on. Excellent prospect on the inside. SF Flyby on the outside. These two are going to hit the wire together. SF Flyby gets up to win an excellent prospect. To go second. Kiki's Magic was third. Down to the mile, 157. Four fifths. SF flyby and a new lifetime mark. Photo for a win. Eight one four nine is unofficial. Eight one four unofficial. Track side of the winner circle, the unofficial winner of the first race, Phillies and Mares, 157 and 4 fifth for a new lifetime mark in the fifth win in 2005. Here's the 8 SF flyby. A five year old chestnut mare by Turbo Twin, head of a Warren Hanover mare, PV May. Owned, trained, and driven nicely here this evening by winning trainer, driver, owner, Bob Zupkoff of Monroe, Michigan. The 8 SF flyby, 157 and 4, new lifetime mark, returns 1540, 560, 440. Second of the 1, excellent prospect, 460, 460. Third of the 4, Kiki's Magic, 620. Well, the 8 1 exact is worth $90.80, while the 814 try is worth $758.80.